she is one of the worst gangsters in the world. <laughs> one of the worst gangsters no one has yeah, And she has to be willing to do things that show her gang, as well as rival organizations, what she's made of. Things like shooting the Caterpillar Club and killing everyone inside. Red yeah, I, I thought so! Drive to her real name, Ruby. Ruby Miller has been sweeping the country, moving in on other gangsters' territory, and either wiping them out or running them out of town. Based on how Ruby. easy it was for her scout to convince both Leonard and Hazel to backstab Lucky Coleman and join her gang instead, she yeah. knew it wouldn't be too hard to take over his territory. The Carlsville gang thought everyone in the yeah. Caterpillar Club was dead. See, he was there to meet someone on the side the hit the, the ground when the bullets started to fly. Moments later, a man you fell on him, dead, barely able to breathe beneath the dead man. Fanny passed out briefly, and when she came to a few minutes later, the barrage of bullets had stopped and the Carlsloe gang had retreated. Fanny escaped from under the dead man and made her run for it. Red-Eye Carlsloe is no fool, though. And she left behind a member of her gang dressed as a hobo to watch the police investigation. This hobo watched Fanny flee from the back alley and recognized her from the Half Moon Club. The gang decided to stop by tonight and have a little chat with Fanny Birchwood to determine what she knew and whether she recognized Ruby. It was clear from her reaction to seeing Ruby tonight that she did. Red Eye Carlswell was not one to let others do the dirty work for her. She enjoys getting her hands dirty far too much to let anyone else have all the fun. And so, she followed Fanny to the washroom. When she was alone, pulled her into the alley. There, she lit a cigarette for Fanny, dropping her second glass match in the exchange. Fanny hadn't even finished her cigarette when Ruby shot her. Ruby Miller then returned to the hallway, where she shared a smoke with Fred, and planned to return to the party for a short period of time before she and her gang would leave quietly, returning another night to inflict the same damage upon the Half Moon Club as they did the Caterpillar Club, if Lucky didn't leave town. Ruby Miller, aka Red Eye Carlsville, is Ooh, guilty of a flapper murder at 1920's Speakeasy. Yeah. <laughs> Show us your pistol. <laughs> <laughs>